While it hasn't been the smoothest sail as of late, Arizona State completed the sweep over Lindenwood with a 5-3 victory on Saturday, marking just the second sweep in the second half. The Sun Devils scored a total of 13 and had just over 90 shots on goal during the two-game series. What I was happy with was, you know, we, we haven't had a ton of puck luck this year, and we didn't have any tonight, and, and the other team did, and our guys stuck with it and found a way to, uh, to, to get a win. The series was a competitive one, as referees had to step between players several times throughout. Tensions were at its peak in the first period of Saturday's game after a hard hit against ASU junior forward Lucas Sillinger, forcing him to leave the game. Lindenwood junior forward Hunter Joannis was immediately assessed a five-minute major in game misconduct as a result. We hope he's okay. You know, I mean, he's, he's obviously coherent, didn't have to go to the hospital or anything, but, uh, you know, it was unfortunate. It was, it was a dirty hit, and we hate to see that. Although ASU sophomore forward Josh Doan earned two goals on Saturday, the biggest play of the night came from graduate forward Chris Grando's backhanded goal early in the third. It was good work by uh, Ducky and, and O working down low, and the puck just squirted out up front and just made a play and, and put it in on the backhand. With a 15-18 and 18 record, just six games remain for the Sun Devils as they continue to push for the program's first winning season since 2019-2020. Up next, ASU will close out a four-game season series against Alaska Fairbanks at Mullet Arena next weekend. In Tempe, Anthony Remedios, WCSN.